Welcome to BK Gardens. Today we are talking microgreens. Microgreens have exploded over the last 15, 20 years. You find them more in restaurants, in grocery stores. They are packed with nutrients. Estimated that they have 40 times the vitamins and antioxidants of fully grown vegetables, whether it's broccoli or kale. They also have tremendous health benefits in terms of cancer prevention, uh, preventing heart disease, and uh, also preventing Alzheimer's. So there's a ton of research coming out about the benefits of incorporating microgreens into your diet. So I had never grown microgreens before. So this was my first foray. And you know, my takeaway was, why didn't I start sooner? This was so easy. Uh, so I'm gonna take you through some of the steps of how to get started, how easy it is to incorporate microgreens into your growing routine and to your life. Uh, first off, ordered um, seeds um, through True Leaf Market. We'll put a link below. Did three varieties, uh, sa basic salad mix here, uh, broccoli, and then kale. The salad mix like grew tremendously fast. I have so much of it. We've been eating it for like basically every day for the last like 12 days and we've still only made a small dent in it. Um, how do you get started? Really easy. After you order your seeds, um, you need an LED light if you're going to be starting off growing inside. Check out my link for how you can set up your LED system for only $150 or less. Again, you can even probably get it under $100. And the, the great thing about microgreens is that they grow super fast. So from germination to first her harvest was about 10 days for us. I got six trays. Um, I'll show you the trays here. Um, trays that I actually put the soil in. I put simple potting soil in with a little bit of um, earthworm castings and a little bit of other, you know, compost um, I had laying around the basement. But you can just start with just potting soil. Um, with a perforated tray right here, you can see the roots going through. And then the second tray is really just to retain the water. Uh, everything I read about the best way to water micrograins is through um, bottom watering. So would pour in about a cup, cup and a half of water the first week in the morning, uh, remainder of the LED lights till about 12, 14 hours. Uh, check it at the end of the day. If it was all dry, I would put another cup, cup and a half of water in just to make sure that this soil remained uh, moist during the whole time of growing. And, you know, by the end, I was getting a feel for like, basically, if I could feel the tray at the end of the day, if it felt light, that means it definitely needed water. Super easy to grow. Again, harvesting is pretty easy. Um, there's a bunch of techniques online about how you can do it more efficiently. I just took scissors, snipped down to the roots, trying not to get that much dirt in. Uh, and we ate this for omelets in the morning, uh, on sandwiches at lunchtime, at dinner with our salad. Even got the kids to start eating them, which was totally unanticipated, but a major win. Kids are not the easiest to get veggies going, but we are trying daily here. Um, but again, major takeaways is for me was why didn't I start growing these things sooner? It's a great way to great, get fresh produce in your house. Um, okay, growing things indoors in the middle of winter here in New York is not easy, but microgreens were a piece of cake. Um, the only thing I think I'll do next time is probably not grow as much because I don't want to go to waste. Like we are at three weeks and it's time to harvest because you know, beyond three weeks, it'll start getting too big and you're, there's nothing micro about it. You've got fully grown vegetables here. But what I'll do is uh, I'll harvest a bunch of this. I'm going to try some juice recipes and then we'll harvest some, give away some to neighbors, and then just do a lot of uh, meals over the next week to eat up the rest of these. So that's it. Microgreens, hit me up questions below. We'll put in links on uh, the information about how I got started. Um, again, easy super delicious and great for you. That's it for uh, BK Gardens Microgreens. Sean Duggan signing off. Keep growing.